So I have two different podcasts that I put out on a regular basis, and I manage both of them here in Notion. I wanted to show you quickly how I do that. So one of them is called A Brighter Web. This is one we publish every two weeks, interviewing marketing people we know. Uh, so this is how I have in here. That's a, the board style. You can see potential guests I want to talk to, people I've invited, haven't heard from, people that are scheduled, and people I've recorded. And then further down is people that have been published. So the way I have it is a few different things at the top. First, I have a uh, template here for add new episodes. So if I click that, it kind of gives me a starting point with all my notes in it. Um, you see, you know, a quick podcast intro. I'll fill in the guest and the title that I want to be said. I usually do the same kind of set of questions. Add a bit more in here if I need to. You know, I'll call this episode, I'm not sure where we are here, but, you know, 50 or so. And this is going to be Bob Smith. And I'll slowly start filling that stuff out. Um, but what it does is it creates that up here and I can drag this into invited or... If he's scheduled wherever Bob needs to go, I can now drag that card around. It has all that stuff built into it. And then the other piece I have in here are promotion, just for some quick notes on how to promote, what I want to do when one's finished. And then the email to potential guests, when I want to reach out to Chantel or Jason to maybe get that going. Um, I have an email I can use. And again, I'll customize this a bit, but kind of gives me a quick start, you know, update the dates, whatever needs to happen. But it gives me that all in one place for there. The other podcast I have, I do very similarly, but this podcast I put out Whenever there's a need, I guess you'd say, it's like a 90 second podcast called Digital Cast. That's just about what's going on with Google and WordPress and the, the digital world, trying to help digital marketers out there quickly keep up with everything. I hear a lot like, how do you keep up with this stuff? And this is intended to help with that. Uh, so it's a similar setup. I have ideas in here, I have ones I record, and then when I publish them, they go over here. And again, typically I publish any weekday that I have one. So this will go out Monday morning. I'm recording this on a Saturday. So this will go out Monday morning. Um, ideally, over the weekend, I'll have a few of them, and I'll have stuff ready about Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, whatever. Similar kind of thing at the top. If I hit Add New Episode, it kind of creates just a little generic one. So I'll add in my little headline. I have my little quick quick talk there, and then the body of what I'm going to say, and then the link at the bottom where I'll have my full show notes that go in this format. So whatever episode this is, episode 51, and I do that. And then the URL for whatever notes, usually it comes from a source. Google published something, or Search Engine Journal did, or someone saw so quickly add that, that URL in here so I have it when I'm building the proper show notes out in WordPress. Uh, but again, I have this in the top that's created for me now so I can drag it into ideas or kind of move it along as we go. Um, and then promotion, similar to the other one. Here's how I want to promote it every time. I want to make sure I have some notes here. I need to tidy this up a bit more perhaps, but it has everything in there. And then a new one I just started adding with stats because with this podcast in particular, I publish it a lot of different places. I do it through Anchor FM, which is a great podcasting platform. And people that listen to the podcast natively, the stats show up there. But I also take it and run it through a product called Wave, W-A-V-V-E dot C-O, that basically make, you've probably seen some of them on Instagram and other places where it's an audio podcast with kind of a still image with little static music bumpers going up and down. Uh, so I push the podcast to a lot of those places, and they get pretty good tra traffic on there. The problem is they don't count as an actual podcast listen in the anchor stats. So I go through periodically and look at those stats. So if I pull that up here... Um, I built a table so I can see each episode, how much is listened on Anchor, on YouTube, on Instagram, on LinkedIn, on Twitter, and then what the total listens are for that episode. And you can see, it's kind of a side note, LinkedIn, man, some of these people listen to on LinkedIn a ton. Um, I'm surprised YouTube is tiny, you know. But anyhow, it's, it's interesting to see these stats, and I can look at the bottom and say, okay, on Anchor, they've been listening to 1,300 times on YouTube 90, and kind of get all the stats there. Of course, this doesn't keep up by itself. i got to periodically go through and, and add that stuff up. Uh, see what's going on, but it's nice to have all the stats. And again, using some of the formulas that are in here, you know, I built a pretty simple formula on the side here. Um, we'll edit that real quick. And you can just see it's it, I put, put YouTube plus Anchor plus LinkedIn plus Insta plus Twitter at the top, just all across here is all that is. You literally just put a plus sign in between, keep clicking the properties, and it'll put that total in. And then if I wanted to, I could adjust the format of the number here. You can, if you want to do percentages or dollars or whatever, there's some neat little tools with that. But in this case, it's just pure numbers. So the stats work out well for that. So that's really all there is here. And you kind of see, um, again, in each one, it does that basic layout. And then I go and kind of fill it out. So, okay, here's kind of a little hook at the beginning. And then my little generic sentence. And then what I want to say in the actual podcast. And again, this is the full text of this one because this is a short, precise podcast. And then at the end, it's okay, here's where the show, show notes are going to be. Here's the URL I need to add to the show notes. Kind of get it all ready to go. So this one's recorded and ready. I have the blog post ready. And so then on Monday, I'll publish it drag it over here and then work through the promotion real quick to get it onto Instagram and YouTube and all the other places it needs to go. So it's a couple different podcasts I have and how I manage it. But again, like with most of these videos, I'd love to see what you have going. Uh, if you manage podcasts, there's lots of different ways you can do it and lots of depth you can go. Both of my podcasts are very simple and fairly raw. I don't do a lot of post-production and stuff, but I'm sure you can do some great processes for that in this. 
uh, using templates and that sort of thing. So I hope that's helpful. Thanks.